Hi, my name is Biagio. I'm a librarian from the Yonkers Public Library. Today, I'm just going to show you a quick tip on how to, how to convert um, something from the internet into a PDF file. Uh, this is useful for when you don't have a printer, but you want to save something so you can always refer to it um, quickly. So, this is what, I'm going to just give you an example of what, what I would do. I play a little guitar, okay? So, I, I go to this website here, and I see, um, I'm a, well, I'm a Bob Dylan fan, so I go to this certain website where they have all these chords on, on a how to play Bob Dylan songs. So, you know, I want to save this. I want to have this on my computer. I don't have a printer. Um, so what do I do? You know, how do I, how do I conserve this for myself? Uh, well, it's simple. Um, I go to, I go to the website where, um, this is located at. And if you look at the right hand corner here, there are three dots right here where my cursor is at the right hand corner. You click those three dots. You go down to print. Since I don't have a printer, by default, it's going to say save as um, PDF. However, if you do have a printer, it might not say that. So you might have to um, click on, on the arrow here and choose it. But in my case, I, by default, I already have it as save as a PDF. Okay, so what do I do from here? Well. I press the save button. It's going to ask me where do I want to put put uh, this um, uh, um, PDF in. Well, for now, I'm going to leave it on my desktop. I could easily uh, put it in any folder that I want to, but for this demonstration, I'm just going to use the desktop. So I choose that, click on desktop, and uh, the website already has the name of the PDF. Um, I'm set up for me, which is blowing in the wind, which is the name of the song. And that's how I would write it in as, as well. But I could write in whatever I wish really, but I want blowing in the wind. It's good. And once I'm done with that, I just press save and it should save to my desktop blowing in the wind. Here it is. So now this is my file. I have it on my computer. If I need to reference it, I it's right here for me. I don't need to go back to the website and look for the song. So that's it. That's just a quick tip. Um, you could generally do this on Google Chrome with 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 any website really. Um, so uh, yeah. So thank you very much and have a good one. Bye-bye.